half when they look very sharp. Yeah, absolutely. I think we, we look for 60 minutes pretty much very sharp. That's absolutely what you want to see and then it's clear. And you have to play a little bit, or we have to control the game a bit more than, as we, than we did and we have to say but they have Norwich. And all my respect, <laughs> they stayed cheeky, they stayed, they stayed, they didn't care about the result, they just enjoyed their football. Um, so, and then we had not enough possession in that in that, in that that period, actually. We had, I think, start of the second half immediately, we could have scored number five and maybe six. Didn't do that. And then they, they, they scored their goal and we were not, never in danger, really, but we had to work a lot to keep the result like it was. And, um, yeah, it was, of course, everything was good apart from... Ali situation is just, just madness, um, but yeah, that's how it is. Um, what a very early prognosis, obviously, but but it appeared to be his calf or something. Yeah, it's a calf. Yeah, and he felt he was looking obviously behind if something hit him because um, he that's how it felt. And it's not a good sign, to no. be honest. So um, <laughs> he will not be ready for Wednesday. I think I can say that already. Yeah, um, I mean, obviously, you've you've only just begun working with uh, Adrian, who you brought in in place of Simon Mignolet. He's now gonna he's gonna get a few games for sure. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. So it's good. He was completely relaxed and, and did the um, did the job what he had to do. It's a good goalie for us. So you see it in possession. He's really calm and uh, things that's really important. Of course, shot stopping is always the impo most important thing. But uh, he's good in that. So we we, we knew that from his uh, from the time at West Ham. That's why we signed him. And um, so now he's in charge. That's how it is. And um, good for him. But of course, the little problem is what we have that um, Kuiv Keller um, is back in training, but <laughs> um, after his broken hand um, yeah. uh, he probably needs still a couple of days so we have, we have to think about what we what we can do there because all your next goalkeepers are, are, are very young young and most of them pretty much injured so Kweep is probably the closest to be not injured anymore and he is our number three so he would now be um, on the bench obviously we have to see how we can deal with that but if there's a problem we have to find a solution we'll find a solution and then carry on just very quickly because your front players have been involved obviously in summer tournaments international football and all the rest of it i thought it was remarkable how sharp they were given the given the number of matches they've played since the champions league final yeah, look it's like uh, yeah it's um they had a break they had a break and actually for, for the body it was it was long enough and they were all um, desperate to come back it was not that anybody asked for a longer um, time off or whatever they were really desperate to go to come back and so they didn't lose a lot for, for their physical um, um, standards and um, so they we can use that as well so it's, it's yeah it's good we have to just we have to now be, be a bit smart so in the next um, especially for the next two games because until Wednesday it's enough time but after that we play Saturday immediately so we have to, to make a few decisions and we'll make them and then um, we have to try to win both of these games which uh, obviously is difficult but tonight look it would be only positive what happened tonight because it's uh, it's the first game of the season 60 minutes really super football everything like you wanted um, respect Norwich a lot and we showed that with our work rate that was all brilliant scored wonderful goals could have scored more that's all good and then the last half an hour of course that's normal that's normal in, in that early stages the big shadow is then the Ali situation and that's why you stand, I stand here and it's like not only being happy because of course it's it's not it's not good for us but again we will find a solution and then carry on thank you Jürgen. thank you very much thank you. that's what you have.